Good morning. Thank you so much for joining me today. Let's get into the Word of God. Let's go to the book of Psalms, chapter number 68, and we're going to look at verse number 19. The Bible says, Blessed be the Lord, who daily loadeth us with benefits, even the God of our salvation. Selah. I remember a number of years ago, uh, my uh, my kids were being extra whiny. They were younger, of course, and um, their whininess was really turning into ingratitude. And <clears throat> so I had them sit down and make a list of you know things they were grateful for things that uh, they had that they were glad that they had. Uh, you know, things like uh, a bed to sleep on, you know, and, and uh, a home to live in, you know, pajamas to, to, to sleep in at night, comfortable clothes, you know, to sleep in at night, and, and uh, clothes to go out in the daytime, uh, multiple pairs of shoes, you know, uh, you know toys, and, and all kinds of stuff. I had them, I had them write these things down. And then I had, you know, obviously as a dad, I had to lecture them, <laughs> you know, sat down and gave them a whole big, long lecture. And I told them, look at this list. Um, you know, how many times have you thanked the Lord for these things? And yet how many times have you whined because you did not get what you wanted? You know, and, you know, that may be a bit childish, of course, if they were children. But, you know, if we are honest with ourselves, how many times do we do that? when we don't get our way, when, when we want something really bad and we even prayed about it for a long time and then the answer is no and God doesn't end up giving us what we want, how many of us kind of act like that, <laughs> right? Like my kids did many years ago. I'm not going to lie. I'm guilty. I've done it. I have absolutely been ungrateful, uh, you know, and, and uh, of course I regret it every single time. Uh, but, but I've been there, done that, you know, it's, it's, um, it's, it's one of the greatest temptations, uh, that of, you know, Satan that he tempts us with, uh, on a regular basis to lose focus on what God has given us and focus only on, on the thing that, that we're not allowed to have, you know, that we can't have or that we don't have, you know, maybe, maybe God is, is waiting to give it to us later. But we're so greedy, we want it now. This verse is very powerful. It says, blessed be the Lord. I mean, here the psalmist is blessing God who daily loadeth us with benefits. Daily. If, if we really stop to think every single day, First of all, the day itself to be able to live and breathe and walk and function and work and eat and sleep and see and hear and speak, all of that. Just, just being able to live another day is a gift in and of itself from the Lord. But even within that gift of life, okay, <clears throat> every single day, the psalmist is right, God is loads us up with benefits. And, and especially if you live in America like I do. This is such a blessed country, overflowing with milk and honey, as, as you know, the Bible describes the, uh, the promised land. I mean, it's, there's so much abundance here. God, every single day, is loading us with benefits. And the million dollar question is, have we stopped to take time to thank him for it? Have we stopped to bless the Lord for the daily benefits that he gives us? Blessed be the Lord who daily loadeth us with benefits, even the God of our salvation. That's probably the biggest benefit of all. Not probably, it is, that we have, that we get to keep every day. Aren't you glad that you're saved? Aren't you glad 
that we have the benefit of salvation and a home and a citizenship in heaven because Jesus Christ suffered and died on the cross to pay for our sins that we should have paid, but he paid it. Aren't you glad? Aren't you thankful? Salvation is the greatest daily gift because we get to enjoy it every day because we'll never lose it. For all of eternity, we will get to enjoy salvation. And of course, plus all the other benefits that come with being a child of God. So I encourage you, take the time to thank God for the daily benefits. Bless the Lord for the daily benefits that he giveth to us, to you, and to me. Thank you so much for joining me today. God bless you. Have a wonderful day, and we'll see you tomorrow morning. Bye-bye.